In autumn, the hills of Scotland is filled with the roar of the red deer. It's the time of year when the male stags square off to win the right to breed. It's known as the rut. Now for us wildlife photographers, the red deer rut is one of the most exciting times of the year. And getting close to the action without getting seen and without scaring the red deer away is our top priority. A Tragopan has a variety of products that you can use to camouflage and get close to deer. A few years ago I used the 3D Poncho. The 3D Poncho is lightweight, easy to take with you in your bag and put on when you want to hide. I found this really good to use when I was sitting still to watch the rut. In Gaelic, the name for red deer is Fia Rua, means wild red. And in the Highlands, people once called them fairy cattle. And people believe that fairies milk them on the mountaintops. But the people of those times probably didn't get as close to red deer as we do today. The last year's alpha stag will be surrounded by his harem of females and subordinate males. If a challenger approaches, the alpha stag will quickly stand up to him. And if the new contender doesn't measure up, he's quickly chased off. A couple of years ago, I used the Tragopan V6 hide with additional room. When using a hide, it's essential to do research beforehand and putting the hide up ahead of time in the best possible location. I got permission from the landowners and positioned the hide with a colorful birch forest as my desired background. I was really fortunate and on one of the mornings on the hill, I had a stag walk right past the hide in front of my ideal background. Sometimes, a contender will be evenly matched with the alpha stag and they will end up locking horns and fighting until one of them backs down. One has a lot to win and the other has a lot to lose, so neither will back down easily.
This is great. There's a large herd of deer. Of red deer over in the hill over there. I'm still quite far away, but I think this is a good time to get my 3D camo outfit on. And this is what I love about this outfit. It is so lightweight, takes up so little space, and I am fully covered with this on. So these trousers are uh, one size fits all, and they're quite large, so I can easily get them outside my clothes. It's really handy. One of the really handy things here as well is the new neck covers from Trigo Pants. This is the autumn cover one. Blends in perfect now. There's also a brown and a white one and a spring, which is slightly greener than this. Uh, to go with this outfit, I got my 3D camo gloves. I got the 3D camo sleeve for my camera lens and I got the tripod sleeves. So I'm gonna set that up and I'm still quite far away from the deer, so I'm not really worried that they're going to see me. Very well hidden here. But this is just ideal, and getting this on, I might be able to get a little bit closer here. But here in Scotland, it's still early days. This is coming towards the end of September. You can hear them in the background here, uh, roaring already. But the actual rut usually starts around mid-October, maybe early october -ish, So. Well, it's a great time to come and check the area out, see if I can get some photos here later on. Over 40 deer over here. And one of the benefits of something like this instead of the hide is that I'm free to move now. I can try and work my way a bit closer to the deer and if they move, I can move with them. And as long as I stay downwind, use the terrain to my advantage, hide behind hills and be really careful in my approach, I can be a lot more adaptable. If you want to pick up any of these items, check out photographyblinds.com for US and Canada and tragopan-shop.com for Europe and the rest of the world. I think I'm going to spend a couple of more hours here watching the deer. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time.